Our business is all about doing private label. And private label means you're not a brand label uh, uh, manufacturer, but you're the store name brand uh, on the shelf. Our customers are every major grocery chain within the United States. When they want a private label on their product, we produce it for them. The challenges that we had were in turnover. We would get people in the job and they weren't the right individuals. The number one problem was employee turnover. That was our number one cost. We decided as a group to investigate possibilities of what we could do. We came up with looking into the work keys uh, assessment tool and found out that this was just so logical. We're gonna do this throughout our company as, as quickly as we can because it just makes so much sense. What we found was the ACT solution, work keys, and the National Career Readiness Certificate gave us the ability to reduce the risk of a bad hire. What we've done is we've put the right people in the right job the first time. As we've continued to test people, we have found that our employee base is definitely a higher caliber than what we've had initially. Um, found that it has definitely correlated with both performance as well as some things like attendance and, and that type of thing. So definitely we're in a better position today than we were before we started using it. In 2009, our turnover numbers were out of control for the, for the community and for our company. So in turning to ACT and the National Career Readiness Certificate, we were able to bring those down to just slightly over 2% year to date at this time. The job profiling process is basically a process of using the subject matter experts, the people who are familiar either doing the job or supervisors of the job, and going through a series of tasks that they are required to perform and really delving into what those tasks uh, entail so that you can ultimately depict what level of different skills such as locating information, math or reading, that that actual job would require. For example, if we've got an individual in our quality lab that needs to have better math skills and they've scored at a silver level, they can go back, go into key train, train there, go back and take that section of the test again and hopefully score better and, and increase their level to a gold or platinum. We've had numerous candidates over the past year actually do that, and when they upgrade their skills and they show that they're ready to go to that next level, it helps them to advance, and it, it is a win for both the company and the individual. There's no downside to this. Well, we've been using the work keys, and it's been very useful because we can actually use this assessment tool to give us a lot more knowledge about what type of person we have to work with and what their core skills are. When I first heard about Work Keys and the National Career Readiness Certificate, I was excited mostly because it was standardized. Um, I just thought that it would be a value to us to have a general idea of the basic skills of the employees we have as well as our new hires. Our industry is constantly changing. There are new products that customers are asking us for, and we've got to be ready for that. We need the right machine operators. We need the right people in the quality lab. And for us to continue to grow, we need to have the right individual with that right product. And when you have that combination together, again, everyone wins in that scenario. The turnover is reduced. The training is reduced. And something that I wasn't expecting is it really raised morale within our, our employees. Uh, they, they felt like they had a piece of paper that meant something and a lot of them found out that they were in essence better than what they had even anticipated. Currently, everyone who comes in has a National Career Readiness Certificate. Our next step is the NCRC Plus. That gives us the ability to see the talent, fit, and performance of that individual to see how well they're gonna work in a team environment. When we have the right individuals come into Burner Foods, what we have found out is our safety numbers have drastically dropped. We're currently experiencing the best run without a lost time injury. And we're, we're confident that there's a correlation between the right individual and people working safely. I'll give you an example. Back in 2009, we were running about $300,000 a year in workers' compensation costs. 
in calendar year 2011, that cost is down to about $15,000. That's a result of having the right individual in the right position and understanding the requirements coming into Burner Food and Beverage. If I was to tell another employer, which I do, I let them know that when you implement the Work Keys testing, the National Career Readiness Certificate, the cost is extremely minimal. It has really helped us because uh, now we know more about the employee, we can match him with a particular job based on um, his assessment scores. Uh, he's going to be more successful for us and more productive. Work Keys and the National Career Readiness Certificate is a foundation. It's a foundation that gives the employee a career. It's, an, it's a foundation that gives burner food and beverage an ability to have succession planning, to have the right individual in the right position. Those reading skills, those math skills, those locating information skills, that's the foundation that an individual builds their career on. Uh, we have one employee in particular I'm going to talk about who had heard about Burner and he just wanted to get his foot in the door. So he started on a night shift production, took his work keys test and did very well and when we had a quality position open, he applied for that position. Today he is our trainer so he has within a very short time been able to really get into what is a solid career for him for years to come. If that individual is not a long-term employee with Burner Food and Beverage, they take that credential with them to the next opportunity they have in their life. It's the right thing to do for the business, but more importantly, it's the right thing to do for the individual and your community.